Hey guys, Matt Gaming here, and today I'm going to show you how to make a whiteboard animation. So the one that you've, the one, the one that you've seen at the start of the video is what we're going to make. So the first thing you want to do is you want to come on to call outs, and you want to scroll down until you see this one here, the um, simple rectangle, and click onto it. And then what you want to do is you want to just make it a make it so it covers the whole screen so it's like that and you want to make sure and by the way that this is for a 1080p HD and then yeah so just click OK and then we're gonna now come here and we're gonna change the fill to white and the border to white and then we're going to change the font to um, black and we're just going to simply I'm going to just type in um, our, um, Mac, I'll put Mac, it's Mac Gaming so so it's Oops, I need a capital. And we'll put here. So now, what we want to do is we want to probably we'll double click it. And we'll change the font to, let's say, let's see if 80 is big enough. Click enter. Yeah, 80 is a rotten. A right size so what we're gonna do now is because this don't look like a writable text so we're gonna come down here I, I've got one in mind so I'm just gonna click the S and it is this one here so you wanna click that so it looks a bit like a handwritten so what we're gonna do now is gonna go on to our we're gonna go on to layout again press another add layout but on this one we just got to take get rid of all the text and then we're going to make sure it covers the whole thing so about here and we're just going to change the fill to a light grey just so we can see what we're doing then what we want to do now is when I come into our clip bin and import media and these two things will I've already got I'll put the um, link in the description from where you can download it so we're just gonna get both of them and open them so now what I want to do is want to get this bit so you can't change the scribble hand thing so what you want to do is just make these um, the same size or a bit longer if you want so we'll just make it a bit longer so probably about that long and so for both of them like that then you just want to move this a bit so you get to see the hand here so this hand is basically what's going to be moving so as like we are typing or writing so what we want to do is want to get rid of this um, blue layer or green screen so what we want to do is we want to click on to more and go on virtual properties then you want to scroll down to see remove color then we're going to click on the color and press select color and then just click anywhere on the green part. Sorry for that. Wait, just need to click on it again. I don't think it removed it. Oh, that's why you want to make sure it's clicked onto the actual video, the actual part. 
then come on to this then click on that oh it's already got rid of it anyway so that's, oh, no it hasn't so now it's got rid of it we can it will be like this so now what we want to do is actually we want to come on to this again we want to scroll down to the very bottom or no we want to keep us here and where it says um, shrink to fit we want it as 50 percent and actually move this along so make sure the yellow line it it shows the yellow line and just move it up a little bit so just to make sure it's where we start off we're gonna just click the eye and we're gonna move it up to here and then we can click back onto this and then what and then what you want to do is come back to sem you want to move it to 75 and all I want to do is see these this green line over it you just want to move this a bit until you can't see so that that I think will be all right if we go back onto fit to screen yeah cuz you can't really see it now so what we're going to do is going to we can zoom this bit out so it just shows the hand if you want but I'm not going to so I'm going to keep it how it is and actually um, let's see is that yeah and we're just going to get rid of this just move that hand away come on to here and then what, what you want to do is just move this so it's just clear the whole thing so now what we want to do is we want to probably come to here and you want to find where it just hit so so let's see um, let's just move this back a bit so you want to click until you see the hand and you want it so when it comes up and it goes straight back down so that's where it would be so see how it's up here and then it's down here so that's where you want it to be and then what you want it to do is you want to come on to this you want to be on virtual properties still and click add animation and then you want to click onto that make sure that's um, online we're gonna just zoom this bit in a bit so so put it as 28 so there and then we will move this up to 3 5 so three seconds and so like here and then just before we move on just gonna get rid of that so just doesn't I, I think the hands moved a bit so if we come on to that and get that yeah it has so So like that, I'm just going to stretch it out a bit. So like that. And then what we're going to do now is just put this back. And then what we can do is we'll move it a bit out. So it's lined, yeah. So now what we can do is we do the exact same thing but for the hand. So we click add animation. We scroll this back to where it says... 28 so there I think that's on yeah then we move this all the way down to 3 5 so there and what you want to do is you want to move, move this so it's gone past this blue dot 
and you want to just come on to the X axis and just hold do you know what I'm just gonna stop that bit because it's probably best to do this one first so we're gonna just move this Y axis I mean X axis sorry And it it will start zooming or oh, going quicker. So we want it just so it hits the E. Whoops. So we're just gonna go back a bit. So that'll be fine. And then we can get this. Then do that bit all over again. So then this bit's just hitting it. That's gone a bit too far. Whoops. So we want it so that we'll say here. So now what you want to do is you want to find where the hang starts to go down. So just keep on tapping this. So you see the hang going down. So we're just going to go up until it keeps on going up. So we'll just say about here. So what you want to do is you want to just cut that bit. And then we can shrink this down to um, 3, 5. Maybe not. So where this is, so where it ends. So we'll cut it where it's set for um, 4.11. And then what we'll do is split it again. Cut this bit out. Then move this down here. So what we're going to do, I'm just going to cut this bit. So that'll be enough time. So it reads it all. Cut that bit. And so this is approximately the part. So if we come here, so all what you would see is just you, you wouldn't you wouldn't see nothing. This will just be a white screen. So we'll change that in a sec. And if we just hold this or just tap it, we'll see the hand coming up. And then it will start moving and it will start writing down. So we'll, so you get the picture. So now what we can do is we can come up here. And go onto our clip bin. And we can get this sand. And we want this so where our hand starts. So, so there. And then we want to get this here. And then we want to cut it here. And get rid of everything else. And then we want to lower the volume down on this. Probably about like that. So then it will give you the scribbling sound. So if we just play the scribbling sound, I don't think I can hear it because my volume's low. Let's we'll turn it up a bit. Yeah. So that that let's have a hear of that. OK, 
Okay, that sounds... I'll say that sounds okay. So then what you want to do now is you want to click produce and share. And I like to go on to... You want to go on to um, one of these four. So I'm going to go on um, MP4 only up to 1080, 1080p. So you want to click onto that and then click next. And then we'll call it, it's Matt Gaming here. Oops. So like that, and then we'll just click finish, and it will start to render. It so I'll come back when it's stopped rendering. Okay, now it stopped rendering. It'll come onto here. It'll come up with this, and then now that would show. But because I'm a stupid person, I forgot to get rid of um, this bit here. So we're just going to get rid of this before we fully save it. So we're going to come on to this. Come on and click on this. And then we're going to change the field to white so it don't look like that. So we're just going to, sorry, not import media. So we're going to do the exact same thing again. Click next. Put on it's Mac Gaming. Here. And then click finish. Then I'll let this render again. Okay, so now this is actually rendered. You'll see it as this, and I would say that's okay. So we can click off that and click finish. So I hope you like and subscribe this video. This is Matt Gaming signing out. Peace. <laughs>